Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's your boy YBK here, back with another video. And today I'll be showing you guys how to get rid of this annoying error right here. Yeah, so without further ado, let's get into it. Alright, so as you can see when I double click on GTA 5, I get that annoying error. And this fix works for all other games and softwares also. Alright, so first you're going to go to the browser. And you're going to type AIO runtimes and search. You're going to select the one at the top. All right, then you're going to select on download. And you're going to scroll until you see download for Windows. So download for Windows. Click on it and then select on download. But I already have it downloaded, so I'm not going to go ahead and download again. So I'm just going to close this right here and cancel that and minimize here. All right, so you're going to go to the folder after you download it. This is where I have mine. And you're going to right click and select run as administrator. Then you're going to wait for it to launch. All right, so it's unpacking so the software can open. So just wait on this to load. It's not going to take very long. All right, so now that the program has been opened, you're gonna go ahead and minimize this and ensure that you select all of the items here. So you're gonna ensure that everything is ticked and select this one right here, Adobe Shockwave Player. All right, and then you select on install. All right, so the installation process has now been started. So now you need to wait for this process to be completed. All right, guys, so now that this has finished the installation process, you're going to double click on whichever game you tried to open, select run, and wait on it to open. All right, and as you can see, it is now loading. All right, so if you need any other game or software fixes, please comment below and let me know and I'll see how best I can help. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share. I'll see you guys next time.